Welcome back to another episode of the Casey Campbell podcast. Casey Campbell with you, of course, pleased to be joined by Caleb Webb of Brighton Football. How's it going? Good. How are you? Good. Well, coming off a win, a big win against Heartland. Um, I know it's been uh, I know it's been a, a tough few weeks for you guys, but what? How did it, how good did it feel to get that big win? I mean, it felt pretty good. Heartland, as you know, just one of our top rivals. So coming in, just a whole different atmosphere, just ready to win, just ready to go out there, and we did it. Yeah. Just um, you know, playing you know county rivals. What 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 is the, what are those games like? I mean, it's just like, and it was a home game too. So walking in just felt like a whole different feeling. And I mean, even in youth football, like those of our top people that we played, Heartland and Howell, those are just the people we don't like the most. So coming in, just a whole different game. So yeah. yeah. Um, of course, um, you know, a lot of people have kind of seen you you know you know play of course uh you're a tight end if i'm not mistaken if uh, um so what 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 has it been like just this year just just building and progressing um getting ready for this season um i mean at the beginning was difficult so was this was my first year of actual varsity football and coming back after two years of not playing officially so felt weird in the beginning but i've kind of been picking it up getting better yeah. Um, what were some of the biggest things that you worked on during the summer? Um, I would say route running and uh, speed for sure. I mean, I already had pretty good hands at the beginning, but definitely my route running was not that good. So I had to work on that a lot. Me and Grant definitely worked together, got better together. So that was yeah. good. Yeah, I know that, uh, you know, I know Grant got a couple games, you know, in last year, but what was it like just work? What is it just like been working with him? Because uh, I know he has been really doing, he's been really putting in the work this season. Oh yeah. I mean, it's great. I can just feel the energy from him. It just makes me better on the field. Just looking at him, he's just calm and it makes me calm. It makes me play better. So, yeah. yeah. Um. So, you know, really going in, it's like, uh, you know, not not too many guys are. You don't. You know, it's very rare that you see a six eight uh, someone <laughs> six eight out there. But uh, what what is that like? Uh, you know, I mean, obviously height's a big big factor in you know being able to do. Um, what what is uh, you know, just just kind of just building up. What was it just like catching the football and you know just scoring and all that stuff? I mean, def it feels great. I mean, I feel like I definitely have an advantage. But uh, I would say probably my weakness would probably be my speed because, like, other people, they don't have the height, but they do have the speed. So that's probably my my worst weakness right there. Absolutely. Um, so, and then, of course, um, you know, really, I think that these next few weeks are, you know, going back up to uh, – in the with the PSEP campus uh, for for Canton and for Plymouth, so uh, you're home for the next two weeks. So what's that going to be like going up uh, going up there? I know you were already up there earlier this year, got a win up there. Um, what's that going to be like heading into those two games? Um, definitely have to bring it for sure. Canton and Plymouth are both tough teams, so definitely have to be in our A game, strive for greatness. So absolutely. All right. Well, um, also, let me ask this. How do you how do you mentally get ready for a game? I mean, it all starts the, day, uh, the night before the game. I like to go to bed around 8.39, just relax, try not to do anything, do my homework right when I get home, right after practice. Then in the morning, I just pray before I go to school and just focus at school, try to get my mind, listen to music, get my mind right. Then at the locker room, I'm just fully locked in. Just try not to talk to many people. Just focus on myself. Focus on doing good. All right. Let's get to know you a little bit. How about that? All right. All right. Um, best high school moment so far in your uh, football career? Oof. I would say my football career, probably getting the two-point conversion yesterday or Friday, Friday night. Sorry. <laughs> um. Let's see. Uh, favorite player growing up? Hmm. I would have to say uh, Des Bryant would probably be my my top pick for uh, favorite players. Yeah. Um, and then finally, um, let's see. Um, what is what would what is something people do not uh, know about you? Not to put you on the spot or anything. Hmm. I would say top thing. 
And I'm 50% Dutch, probably. Yeah. Not many people know that. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, Caleb, thanks so much uh, for popping on here and uh, best of luck um, uh, this weekend against Canton. Yeah. Thank you for having me.